going to be doing another haul video. Um, the past few times I've done a haul, I've apologized and been like, I do so many hauls, that's all I do is hauls, I'm sorry, but here's another haul, I have a shopping problem. And I've gotten a lot of feedback from you guys saying, don't apologize, please show us everything when you shop because we like to see your hauls, that's why I'm subscribed to you. With like a couple people, that's what they said to me, is that's why they subscribe is because the shopping hauls and not many YouTubers do shopping hauls, so that's what they like to see. So. That's just what I'm gonna do because you guys seem to really enjoy it. So I'm gonna stop apologizing and just do hauls when there's hauls. I love that I'm one of these like haul channels. I would definitely just be a strict haul channel if I had the money and I just like shop and showed you guys everything. Goals. But today we're gonna be all Hello Kitty Riffic and give you guys a haul. The very first place that I went was Showcase. It's like an as seen on TV store, home of the hottest trends. One of these bras that are so trendy. Me and my mom both got one. They're these, it's like a little stick on exactly where the picture is. It's like a stick on bra you just stick on your boot. It doesn't have straps or anything because even right now because my hair is covering it that's why I wore this. If I was going out I wouldn't wear a bra or I would wear this. So you wouldn't see this happening even like right here because it's just like right there and it has a little drawstring that you can go like this and it just sucks your boobies right up. If you guys want me to do like a little Snapchat video on this, because if I did it on YouTube, I, I know it would get flagged. And if I did it on Instagram, I know it would get flagged. Well, maybe, because other people do it on Instagram. Let me know if you guys want to see me do it on Instagram or Snapchat or both, then I will do that because Snapchat will disappear. And maybe I'll put that Snapchat video on my Instagram when it's disappeared. I don't know, but um, maybe it'll work. I'm not sure. I did get a C cup just because I am a double D. I think that's what I got size two. Am I wrong? I don't know. You guys would know more than me because I remember I did a video on a vlog on it and I got sized. But the D looked very big and I like to wear like little, like it fit, it would have fit me, let's be honest. I like to wear things that are little. So if I do like a little shirt, the, the bra can make up to here or kind of, but I just want it like little. It's probably not going to fit as good. So I did get a C cut. My mom got a size lower as well. Um, so I don't know. That's that. It was only $19.99. So I feel like that was a good price. The next place is a store called Eclipse. I don't know if you guys have this in your city. My mom loves this store. It's really cute. Like it's just a little tiny store. I think we only have one of them in our city. And I just didn't really like the styles in there. Usually I love them, but I was kind of like merp. But then I saw this, it's a little bodysuit. I was wearing a bodysuit today. I just love bodysuits that they like keep your shirt down and then you can wear little like high-waisted shorts with it or jeans. I think this would look so good with some jeans on. Oh my gosh, I might wear this out this weekend. Might have to wear a bandeau on it. I don't know. We'll see under it, I mean. And it's just florally. Just really nice. I liked it. I said just like just 10 times. $34.99 originally, which was cool. I'd pay that, but it was on sale for $19.99. I'm not sure why, because I feel like this is like folly kind of. Maybe not with like the summary print, but I felt like it was fall vibe, okay? Okay, the next store that we went to was a store called Dutch Growers. I wanted some sunglasses and belts. I really don't have any cute belts, so we went in there and I found both. So this is like a holographic, super trendy. I don't care about trends, but if it's cute, then I'll do it. You know, that bra thing was super, super trendy, but I'm not gonna get it unless it's gonna benefit me, and I think it really will. Same thing with this belt. I love like little, this reminds me of so 90s. I felt like it was like what I would have worn in the 90s with like a Barney t-shirt that my mom would have dressed me in. This was $29. Dutch Growers has like really different brands. If you do live in my city and can't find a lot of, you know, cool things, then I would definitely go into Dutch Growers and check it out. Uh, the one thing that I got was this. This was on the sale rack as well. Me and my mom were like raiding the sale rack because it was last chance stuff. And this was originally $85 on sale for 40. So I did get a steal of a deal. And the brand is Papillion. Yeah, I was questioning this, but a lady, when I tried it on, she walked by and she didn't even know me. And she just turned around and was like, that looks so good on you. I'm like, thanks. My mom even said it too. And it's just very like light and airy. Um, it's like an over open thing like this. And the bottom have little tiny tassels, not like ridiculous. I've seen some tassels that are like on to like this long and like braided and wound up and all this. These were very simple. They had like little, just tiny little cross crisscrossy things here and just simple little thin not like huge gaudy even though I like gaudy shit but it was nice and like just thin and breathable it was cute to just throw on and go so I got that for a steal of a deal and then there was this 
rack. This lady told us that Free People, which I, you probably have heard of that brand before, very amazing brand, they have lots of Free People stuff there and I was obsessed with the brand. So they bring in these like concept pieces. What did they call them? Sample, like Free People sample sales. They're just like sample little products to see what people are liking and wanting to purchase. Like the actual tag looks like this. There's like writing on it. This is like the inside of the actual clothing tag. And I loved this by Free People and I tried it on, it was just gorgeous. So I need to wear this before summer ends. The tag says the Cora dress, it's called the Cora dress. Free People sample sale, 50 bucks. That's just how much it is. So it doesn't tell you how much originally it is because it's just like a little sample sale. I wish I could have more explanation to tell you really, but I think that's so cool how they just bring in little pieces to see what people are wanting. And this is the dress. I am in love. It has little like split sleeves here with these hanging down and it cinches in at the waist and oh my goodness it's so pretty these little tassels here these ones are quite long but you can what I did when I tried it on is I wrapped them around so the tassels were just a little bit hanging there it reminds me of like a modern day jasmine dress like princess jasmine now what I'm so excited for I hate velvet so I'm not gonna feel that my mom found and she found them as I was snapchatting so if you saw her trying to put sunglasses on me that's what these were from she found me and I didn't even know they sold them quay sunglasses and I've seen how many youtubers talk about quay sunglasses and I'm like where do you even get those I went onto their website and it was like quay Australia and I'm like girl Canada can't hang <laughs> well apparently they can because if you're having trouble finding them if you live in my city Dutch growers they had a whole section of quay and I couldn't decide and I came out with these $96 Canadian so if you can convert that to how, whatever you're in I have a ring light on so if you guys follow me on like any of my social medias you'll probably be able to see them better but the ring light doesn't really go it, it honestly they look so good without the ring light on make your eyes look stunning the shape how they ombre really really like these I may have to go back and get some more I was obsessed and the fact that they fit my nose so well I have a very small nose so when I wear sunglasses like this as soon as I look down they like fly off my face or if I'm like driving I'll like turn to shoulder check and they'll be like falling off my face I'll be like oh cool now I'm in an accident I just felt like they were very well made and they had this little case so I won't get them scratched hopefully not I'm so excited about those a little bracelet and this is from Alex and Ani or Alex and Annie. They just had a really good message and backstory to them. The lady was explaining them to me and I really, it was just drawn to it. They have gorgeous stuff if you want to read about it. They're made out of recycled materials as well. That's why they have a little charm on each bracelet for recycled materials. I don't know, I don't know everything. I'm not like a spokesperson for it, but I just really like the message. So this was the card that I got. Um, every piece of jewelry, I'm pretty sure it has a little card and this was called the Celestial Wheel and it's a Taurus. That's me. I'm a Taurus. And it says persistent, determined and, determined, and strong. I don't know about strong physically, but I am strong emotionally and mentally. And it's funny because whenever I hear, whenever I read about a Taurus, the first thing I think of is that's not me. And that's like the first thing about a Taurus is stubbornness. You know, so it's like, you're just proving yourself wrong. So I'll read you if you care. Taurus is confident. Girl, yes. Look at me, I'm so sexy. <laughs> strong and self-reliant, an incredibly hard worker whose practical, realistic approach inevitably leads to success. Taurus believes that a meaningful life is a balanced one, an earth sign who appreciates beauty and comfort. The bull's compassion yields success in both life and love. And that is beauty and comfort. Like, I love the beauty industry, but I also just like laying around the house and being comfortable and wearing sweatpants, but having a bow and cute little hair going on. <laughs> that really does represent me. I love that. The bracelet is gorgeous. The bracelet here was $40, $40 I believe. Gorgeous. So it has like all the little star signs around it, but then there's Taurus here inside and I think that's beautiful. Um, they have three little charms here, which that's what she was explaining to me. The one is USA little heart there because they are made in the United States of America. There's a recycled material and then infused with energy technology, positive energy technology. So all the bracelets are infused with positive energy to give you that little boost of energy and positivity because we all need to be surrounded by positivity. So I just thought this was something that really spoke to me and, and was about me and something that I love and promote mode every day and on the back here it says Taurus um, 420 to 520 which um, my birthday is May 17th persistent determined
determined and strong on the back there as well. So it just, you know, is a little reminder and it's adorable and it's a little fashion statement. So I like that. And the last place in this haul is of course Urban Planet. I got some jewelry. I got a huge pack of chokers because I don't know why I lose my chokers a lot. This was only 10 bucks for one, two, three, four, five chokers in here. So it was two bucks each. I thought that was awesome. So there's um, a little nice soft one with a heart. We've got this kind of like ribbony one. This one here, that's like my favorite one. It's kind of like cheapy looking, but I love. Then we have this plasticky, silvery, sparkly one. And then a bigger nudie pink, like Kardashian style one. And this choker, this is the front of it. It's so cute, leopard, nice and thick. And when I was bringing it up to the front, it said reversible. I'm like, what? And it is on the back here. It's like snake skin print. So I thought that was so cute. This one here was $6.99. And they had some sale. It was like buy. There was honestly like I can't even tell you what I got for what because A, I don't have my seat anymore. And B, they were like this rack is buy two get one free. But this rack is a $4.99 rack. And then the sale rack is buy three get the one. All of these I really got reduced. And I think my whole total was like $80 for everything. So you could like add up all the prices and see. But <laughs> yeah, anyway, this jacket alone was 40 bucks, $39.99, but it had like slashes in it and it was all like, everything was just discounted, okay? So I have a jacket kind of like this, but this one is so soft. The one I have is like a harder material. This one's so soft and pretty. Uh, I hate that I'm seeing like a lot of fall stuff coming out because I love summer, but hey, it has gold detailing on it and it's gorgeous. Hey, I have bandeaus, but they're like just straight across ones. I want this one, which is just, I see these everywhere. These like frilly little beautiful ones. Now you will see my nipple through here. So when I'm wearing a see-through shirt, I mean, if you do happen to see my nipple through the see-through see -through shirt and the see-through little bralette, then I'm honestly not shook. Like, I don't care. Like, you know what I mean? Like, cause you can Google a tit. My tit isn't made of gold, but I would like to not have it just all out. But if you can like see it poking out, I think feel like it's like a real Rihanna vibe. So, I mean, I ain't even mad about that because I want it for a specific top that I have. And this was $11.99. Yes, okay, I do remember this rack. So that's why I got three items because it was buy two, get one free. So I did it twice on that rack. So I'll show you because they're basics but I wear these shirts a lot. So this one here was $14.99 originally. They're so cheap. So this one just is zipped all the way down. Gorgeous color here. My mom has one in like an olive green that she wore recently and I loved it a lot. This one was $9.99 and it's this like mustardy yellow color and it's a little off the shoulder. Little short top has lace on it there. It's like really cute, like a little fossil dress shirt. And this one for $9.99 is a halter and it kind of like, I don't know, this felt like a bib. It looked like a bib to me, but oh well. I didn't really like the color. It kind of looked like, not only that didn't look like a bib, but it looked like baby puke. Like, I don't know, but, but hey, I mean, I'll rock that baby puke all day. And then I got the deal again and I got the same little tank cause I really like that, but in black. All the rest were a size small. This one was $19.99 originally, and it has cut out shoulders here. Just nice little basic pieces that I can wear with different things. And then the very last thing on that rack was originally $9.99, like originally $9.99, so cheap already. And this one was very interesting. So it looks like this and it crosses. I didn't try this on, but I just trust and believe that this one is gonna look cute on And if it doesn't. Value Village will get it. And all of them are the Urban Heritage brand, except for this one was another story. So that's that. When I first saw it, I thought I was gonna say another brand. Like, cause it's just like everything's just, and this is just another brand. So I thought that was funny. Laughing to myself. Okay, then the last thing was this, which I feel like this is really tiny. <laughs> this is a small $14.99 with a big red slash in it. So I don't know where this came from or what rack it was, but it's this little, why did I buy this? I feel, oh well, I mean, it'll look cute. And I don't think it's really even gonna hold my titty. I feel like I should try things on. I always do it at Urban Planet, but this time I was just like lazy AF. And had that it concludes my haul, my shopping haul. If you guys enjoy shopping hauls, then I would really appreciate a thumbs up or subscribe. It's free. Thank you all for watching. Talk to you all in my next video. Bye.